The following is a non-profit fan-based parody. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and Dragon Ball GT are all owned by Funimation, Toei Animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama. Please support the official release. What the hell is going on here? <laughs> Let's answer your question with another question. Yeah? And what's that? Wanna see me drink this guy? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gonna puke. You can't puke. You're in my. Oh, good lord, it's everywhere. Ah. So, Piccolo, what brings you to my neighborhood? I sensed a disturbance. Well, I am pretty disturbing. Remember that time I drank that guy? That was fing weird. So, I take it you're the one who exterminated this entire city then? Oh, no, no, that was another guy. His name was Shit Sherlock. First name, no. Why? Just why? Well, three reasons. First, I was asleep for like four years and I am understandably hungry. Two, there's nothing more satisfying than the rush I get from watching a person disappear. And three, and I need you to pay attention on this one. Huh? Why does it feel like my dad is fighting Mr. Piccolo? And Vegeta is fighting Mr. Piccolo? And Mr. Piccolo is fighting Mr. Piccolo. That's weird. It even feels like I'm out there. It feels like everyone we know is fighting Mr. Piccolo. Except for Yamcha. Well, duh, that's because I'm right here. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Ah, and three. That is how I power the beautiful temple that is my body. You. You're a monster! Oh, I'm a monster! I haven't heard that one scream to me today. Of all people. <laughs> oh, that is just embarrassing! It's not even the right hole. As much as it disgusts me to admit, you and I at least have one thing in common. More than you know, but continue. We both get a significant power-up when we absorb someone. Ominous! <laughs> I can't believe you screwed up the van. Honestly, I don't know what you were expecting. I didn't even get my license before Dr. Giro went all Blade Runner on us. Excuses. Hey, 16! How's that tranny coming along? I don't believe the car identifies as either male or female. So, what do you think that explosion was? Eh, <sighs> who cares? Probably just Vegeta throwing a hissy fit or something. Wait, did you mean the transmission? Because it's fixed. <laughs> Oh, so he fused with Kami. So that's a thing. Did you just spin kick him? I know, right? I've always wanted to do that. Please don't do it again. My body, my rules. Damn it! Huh. Faster than me. That could be a slight pain in the ass. But ah, my ass butt! Ah! Wanna see something cool? Ah! What is he doing? That looks like your technique. Well, it's not. He's doing the finger thing. So Goku does that when he teleports. Oh crap. So that's how you pronounce it. He's gonna kick me again, isn't he? Alright, I'm gonna need you to do me a solid and not kick me anymore. Start by telling me how you know my technique, and maybe I'll consider it. Well, what can I say? Imitation is the greatest form of flattery. Speaking of which... Gah. No! That's impossible! The only one who knows that technique is Goku! And Gohan! And Master Roshi! And Krillin! And Yamcha! And me, that one time I tried it just to see if I could- Damn it! A duplicate time machine, a monster on the loose, and now an entire city gone missing! 
But we still don't know where the androids are. I know, right? <laughs> Total fuster cluck. Ah, when did you... I didn't even feel you. I affectionately refer to it as stealth mode. So, what are we looking at? I have no idea. It could be a giant cicada monster for all we know. Hopefully Piccolo will be able to hold his own until... Ah! So was that Piccolo or... Piccolo Piccolo? <sighs> this thing's just full of surprises. Surprise! Uh, uh. Oh, hey, he's behind you. Howdy, neither. Oh, it must be your first tie because you are tight. And unfortunately for you, it's also your last. Uh, he's drinking your arm. I know! Well, then do something. I am! Ah, my feet mouth! Oh, God. You're even starting to look like Kami. Dick. You sure you don't want me to do the other arm? Even you out? Because that's just distracting. Listen, I've obviously lost this fight. Without my arm, I'm finished. Wait, can't you regrow your- Shut up, Nail. He's doing a thing. Ah, submission. A second favorite to futile resistance. But before you finish me off, <laughs> how about you tell me everything about you? Oh, well... Unless you don't have anything important to say. No, no, it's just... You're the first person to ask me who or what. Normally, they just ask, why? Well, to start us off then, I'm sure by now you're more than familiar with my father, Dr. Giroux. Oh, God damn it! Oh, but wait, there's more. I am purely biomechanical, unlike my brother and sister, Cyborg 17 and 18. We call them androids. Well, good for you, you're wrong. As I was saying, our father created me with the sole purpose of becoming Perfect. Infused with the genetic makeup of the galaxy's strongest warriors, collected over several decades. So that's how you know our techniques. Oh, but I know much more than that. I know that in this timeline, there lies the secret to my true, perfect form. A secret I had all but conceded lost to me. This timeline? So you're from the future, but how? Oh. Ah! I found a way. All you need to know is that I am here now, and I will stop at nothing to achieve my perfection. Well then, I guess I know your story. You're welcome. But I don't know your name. Ah, oh, truth is, I don't really have one. But all things considered, I think I'll go with... Cell. That's kind of boring. Coming from the guy named after a woodwind instrument. You know what? Doesn't matter anyway. I'ma drink you now. Wait. Before that, do you want to see something cool? Now I know you're playing me, and I do. Oh, that is hardcore! Also not good for me. Also not good for me! What the hell is that? And why is it giving me the most ominous sense of deja vu? Sorry kids, not telling the story again. But I will leave you all enlightened. Start a flare! This DM's thing! I fucking know! Okay, what the hell am I sensing? Is that the Namekian? Is that me? Is that me stronger than me? I'll kill me!